Good afternoon. This morning I powered up my Linux install. I wanted to do some stuff on my machine. Only being greeted with this error that you see on the screen here. When I was trying to access some of my system disks, they came back with error mounting the disk and it contains an unclean file system. Metadata kept in Windows cache refused to mount. I did a lot of searching on the net and there were a few articles that I found. Easiest way, a lot of, well, before I tell you what the easiest way was, a lot of the articles basically stated to delete some file, etc. But the easiest way for me was to boot into my Windows and switch off the fast boot option. So basically, the first thing you need to do is boot into Windows 8 and the second part of the video after this part I will show you on my Windows 8 recording how to do that. After you've disabled that setting on Windows, reboot back into your Linux install and voila, let's open this and I can open my system disks. So now to the second part of the video to show you how to turn it off. I've tested this, I've shut down and rebooted, logged back into Windows 8, then back into Linux and it works. No more unable to mount disks that are, well, that contains an unclean file system. Let me show you how it looks like and where to do it in Windows 8. I'm now on my Windows 8 install. This is on a separate disk than my Linux Mint install. If you have the Metro interface and you don't have a start button here, then go into the right hand corner here, click on settings, control panel, and it will open probably a different screen. But basically what you're looking for is this power options. Now in this power options, you want to click on choose what the power button does. If your screen looks a bit different, look at the bottom here. It should also tell you or state there, choose what the power button does. So click on that. What you want to turn off is this, where it says turn on fast startup. This is causing issues with the Linux installs when you dual boot. I need to change settings that are currently unavailable. If it was grayed out, you can click there. Turn this off, go save changes, and then reboot your machine in back into Linux and you should be able to access your system drives. Comment below if this was informative or helped you about a bit. Uh, I'd like to know if you managed to come right. If not, also post a comment. We'll see if we'll be able to assist you. Thanks for watching. Chat soon.